Welcome to USMLEFastTrack.com. The section we're going to talk about today is from First Aid for the USMLE Step 1, 2013 Edition. Page 570, Rapid Review. What is the cause of cranial nerve 7 palsy? Cranial nerve 7, which is also known as the facial nerve palsy, can occur due to lower motor neuron lesion. What is the idiopathic form of facial nerve palsy called? Idiopathic form of facial nerve palsy is called Bell's palsy. So if facial nerve palsy happens due to lower motor neuron lesion, that's called cranial nerve 7 palsy. And if it's idiopathic, then you call it Bell's palsy. Describe the classic clinical presentation of facial nerve palsy. The classic clinical presentation of facial nerve palsy is unilateral facial drooping involving the forehead. For more information on this topic, click on the link in the description section below. For a full USMLE Step 1 review, be sure to check us out at usmlefasttrack.com where we help you review the entire first aid for the USMLE Step 1 with high quality videos and hundreds of detailed pictures for a better understanding of the material. So to learn from the best USMLE review book, be sure to check us out at usmlefasttrack.com.